The friends of a woman killed in a gas station shooting in Greensboro are remembering her strength. 72 year old Patricia Grant died last Thursday after she was shot at the Speedway on Battleground Avenue. The shooter is still on the run. WFMY News 2's Jess Winter spoke with friends who are setting up a memorial in her honor. Jess. In addition to the growing memorial of flowers and candles, there's now a new poster that reads Justice for Pat. Rhonda Pedraza put it out there as she seeks answers in the killing of her dear friend. To me, this was something that I felt I could do to make me feel less helpless and to try to help the family. Rhonda Pedraza is making signs, t-shirts. She also started a GoFundMe after her close friend, 72-year-old Patricia Grant, was shot and killed at the Speedway gas station where she worked. Pat was just a wonderful person. She always had a smile on her face. Greensboro police say it happened around 6 a.m. Thursday. Just three minutes after she opened the store for him to come in and do this. I mean, it's an animal. It's like a rabid animal. There's there's no reason for it. Pedraza says Grant leaves behind her sister, Judy, who was also her roommate. She's devastated. She's heartbroken. She's angry. She was a mother and a grandmother, too. She has three grandchildren that live here. So it's very sad. Nearly a week later, no arrests have been made. Greensboro police have not released suspect images. I don't think they want to jeopardize their case. I'm trying very hard because I just want to start crying. I just hope they find who did this. The U.S. Bureau of Labor Statistics consistently ranks cashier as a dangerous job. Pedraza says she was a cashier herself and thinks that there should be more protections for them, like bulletproof glass.